Welcome, Pisces. This will be a reading just for you, Pisces. Pisces, I know what's going on with you guys since for a while there. Well, I'm trying to, I will try to do this reading for you because I'm blocked with Pisces and Leo for like many months. I don't know why it's happening, but every time it's like, oh, oh, don't do that. Okay, I'm not doing it. But I will try Pisces tonight. Uh, let's see. From your past life, Pisces. You used to live with many, 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 many people. I don't know if today you you love to live with a lot of people or you just want to be, or, you know, living alone maybe. Prefer that. You have a lot of wisdom. No wonder. Oh. In the past life, you died in a war. Maybe that's why you don't like wars today, right? Look at this. Very spiritual or very religious. It depends. I'll see here very soon. And something is important in your life. It's your father still today. Now, let's see, Pisces. I feel emotional here. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Um, yeah, you feel like moving out. Maybe you want to stay somewhere else. You feel like moving all the time, moving out. So I think you must be a, you know, those people just moving out all over the place, never have a serious place to stay in or long term, whatever here. You just want to travel all over the place. Yeah, you have wisdom. You wish you always wish for something and it comes true. It's like everything's possible for you. You know, you take your pack sack and you just go, right? <laughs> okay, what about that or Oof. Oh. It says here here to reconnect with yourself. Reconnect with who you really are. Uh if you're trying to find yourself everywhere else, uh, no, your yourself is within you, okay? When you know more about yourself, how you feel, uh, why you feel that way, um, you know, when you know more about yourself and loving yourself, because you're special, you know, and some people don't remember that. <laughs> yeah, it's deep, deep inside of you. You are spiritual or very religious, one or the other, but it's, deep deep inside of you it's it's there okay maybe you do believe in it maybe not you are having a second chance i don't know if your dad you're having a second chance if it's with your dad please take that second chance i don't know what is it what it is yet i'll try to okay but you just want to travel all over the place with your pack sack. That's what I see here. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Okay, you have your ups and your downs. Okay, you just like, when you want to travel, it's on the spot. I mean, you don't really think about it. You just do it, right? Okay. Yeah, you feel good. You really do feel good. Because whatever you think, whatever you want to, or let's say whatever you wish for, it's like coming always there for you. It's, it's something happens, it's like, wow, great, you know, I feel good, great. <laughs> um, looking into yourself because it's good for you. You have a lot of knowledge here, okay? You are, well, the guide. You are the one who can guide yourself. Okay, you're alive now. When you're alive, you can guide yourself towards the best in your life. Okay, spirituality. Okay, oh, I see. You think that something is wrong with uh, religion or spirituality? You really think something's wrong here? Something that you keep secret. You don't want to. Oh, I see. Maybe somebody laughed at you because you were spiritual or religious. Oh, boy. You know, when you're <clears throat> not open-minded, well, you're closed-minded, right? 
So now you know, right? <laughs> so you can do whatever you want, but it seems that you keep everything inside. You try not to think about it or like squishing it inside. <laughs> Okay, this is secret, that's right. You know so many things, but especially with the father here. There's a lot of secrets here. But you're having a second chance here. Maybe to solve or to whatever it is here, okay? To solve a problem, an old problem. Okay, let's see what's going on right now for Pisces in this present moment here. Your beliefs again. Your beliefs. Your belief system. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Yeah, you're, you're very psychic. You have a lot of intuition. That's maybe what you don't want to hear about yourself. <laughs> and it makes you... Wow. Okay. You know that you have a strong intuition or something like that. You know that. It makes you feel good, but you're not talking about it. You just don't don't want to show it or something. That's perfect. Uh, maybe there's a sibling here. Masculine energy in the family here that you love. And that masculine energy loves you too. But that masculine energy is not very funny these days. He's like he. Oh, I don't know why I say he. But something's wrong here. Maybe, you know, something is wrong. This is fights, conflicts. This is like, no, you shouldn't do that. Yes, you should. Da, 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 da. It's not your business. Da, 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 da. You know, those, <laughs> those things. Well, you know, what can you do? It's just opinions. That, that's what opinions does. It's always, you know, it's always about conflict and uh, bah, it's only opinions. Yeah. Well, you know what? You're protecting yourself. Yeah, you're true to yourself and all those, you know, negative emotions here from this one here. It's like you're so true to yourself. It's like... The negative emotions are flying away simply. You just let that go. It's like you're really detached. That's what I wanted to say. Okay, what's coming up for you here, Pisces? Remember, this is general. I never know who will have a good time with this. <laughs> the cauldron. Okay, you're very creative. Maybe something you want to do and you have to protect. Like protect your heart. Okay, protect your heart if you want to. You're still happy with what you are and what you're doing in secret. Okay, you're, you're protecting yourself against the religious mantis. Okay, the religious, religious. Okay, somebody is in the religion and it's like hard on you, maybe. <laughs> okay. Yeah, trying to eat you up here and there. Trying to bring your creativity down. Don't talk about anything. Don't talk about whatever you want to do or you want to, sh you know. That's maybe why you're protecting your heart here. You're protecting your psychic gifts. You're protecting yourself. Because there's a lot of opinions here. Maybe they're trying to bring you down because you know this, you feel that, da 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 da. Don't talk too much, okay? Don't talk too much. Here it says. And I don't think you will talk too much this time. <laughs> I think you know now. Stay independent and just do what you like to do. Enjoy your life here and enjoy especially your psychic gift, the moon. I mean, the moon is the moon. <laughs> the moon is water. The moon is the psychic gift. The moon is uh, the subconscious. That's it. Okay, now let's see who's close to you and who's around you. Let's see. Sagittarius. We have Aries here. We have Leo. Very close to you, Leo. We have Capricorn here. Do we have Pisces? Let's see, let's see, let's see. 
No, we have Sagittarius. Oh, 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 oh. It means that Sagittarius is very strong. Not always close to you, but very, it, it's in your mind kind of thing. Okay, Leo is closer. We have two more here, the Aries and the uh, Capricorn here. Okay, in general, it means here, believe in yourself, okay? Believe in your star, believe in all those psychic gifts that you are, that you have. Look, the moon is here and the moon is there. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> believe in yourself. It says, just, you know, be yourself. Okay, you want to hide it? Fine, but be yourself. Just be it um, secretly if you want to, but be who you are. Be humble, because when you're humble... Well, there's more coming in. <laughs> yeah, it says to be like uh, more loving. It, uh, here it says be more loving with yourself, and here it says if you need if you need to just you know retreat, like stay away from people sometimes you know and feel good about yourself. That's that's the best thing you can do because you're learning about yourself. You're learning how to feel good alone. When you feel good alone and you're, you're figuring out who you are spiritually, baby, that's when things comes up. That's when you are awakening. That's when you... we. This is the period for that. Okay? So that's all I have for you, Pisces. Thank you.